the beautiful Philips 783 tuner amplifier was made in the 1980s. And this is the inner side. The tone control and volume control unit, power supply transformer, the end amplifier, the radio uh, stage, and you can see that it was completely made with discrete components. Very high quality amplifier and it still works now in 2017. And I've made some adaptation to the circuit here because the radio on the FM band slide it away from the radio stations somewhat and I think that had to do with the varicap, the variable capacitor diode that's somewhere here now in the middle of the screen and my idea was to make a more stabilized voltage and that's what you see here. But anyway this radio is in fact top quality and nowadays with the chip technology I don't think they make such good quality radios like Philips made in the past. So let's listen to that radio. And now we are switching now to a frequency band, the long wave that's here long wave and let's see how good this radio receives long wave stations Édifiée à l'époque de la Renaissance, la forteresse de Pagliano est l'unique prison qui accueille des mafieux repentis. Pas question donc de Some creaking sounds. No problem. But you can hear here that the bandwidth from this radio is extremely good compared to the frequency that it has to receive. And here we hear some noise, but anyway. The bandwidth and the quality from the sound is extremely good. And there are a few French radio stations on long wave that still are present there and are transmitting. Anyway, we go to the medium wave. And you can hear that also here on the medium wave the bandwidth is good, the sensitivity is good, it has a clear audible sound and all is received on this wire antenna here. So 50 centimeters and here the ferrite rod antenna. So a top radio receiver in my opinion. And let's go to the FM band. Voor een presidentieel systeem, dat hebben de Fransen, dat hebben de Amerikanen. Wat is daar dan mis mee eigenlijk? Ja, dat is ook het argument van de voor. So it's extremely properly uh, sounding FM tuner. That's also here in this high quality radio from the 1980s. That's also the reason why I save these radios when I find them. Um, I salvage them and don't take them apart because of their very good properties.